What's up everybody? Welcome back to Bed Wars. It is great to have you here. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the rotation item, the Wall of Steel. The description says that it spawns a 3x3 three three wall. I would assume out of iron blocks. I should probably preface this by saying I've never used this item before. I've never seen anyone use this item before, but I know that this item is going to be complete garbage. The price is 3 emeralds, and if it does only what the description says, and that is builds a 3x3 three three wall, it is going to be so incredibly worthless. Like, are we actually going to be spending 3 emeralds to build a wall? I just, I wouldn't, I wouldn't believe it. Get down from there. You are building up far too high. And off the edge you go. I guess I got to take out yellow before anything else. Yellow's over here for some reason, even though I didn't want anything to do with them. They decided to take out the base next to me, which I was going to do. All right, what do you want, dude? I guess I'll just take some fall damage. Get off the edge. Didn't work. That's fine. I'm going to steal his generator. Six gold? Sure thing. I'll take it. Okay, I'm heading in. Is he going to fireball? I mean, he's, I see he has a TNT. He has the particles above his head. I wonder what he's going to try and do here. He is now dead. I guess this is one issue with Dragon Star, where half the game is gone, and I haven't really been able to do anything that I wanted to do. But I'm heading off to mid. I need to collect my emeralds, the most valuable resource in the game. I guess some may argue diamonds are more valuable, but, but going to get emeralds so I can buy, you guessed it, walls. It looks like Gray is on the way to mid. Um, let me just go take them out real quick. Must not be playing with sound because I took fall damage right next to him. I did that on purpose because I wanted him to come fight me, but clearly he didn't want to do that. Let me just put the emeralds away for now so I don't feed them to someone. And let's head on over. Does he have fireballs? He definitely does. I don't even know why I ask that question anymore. Like, yeah, they have fireballs. They always have fireballs. Don't put... Okay, dude. Are you going to TNT jump at me? Oh, just past me? I mean, that's fine, I guess. Let me uh, gap up one more time, and over we go. Hey, man. I'm going to try to not... Okay, good. I stopped sprinting when I hit him to hopefully give him less knockback. That way I could not hit him into mid, and uh, it worked out perfectly. He had a lot of stuff stored in his e-chest. What is that about? Okay, blue is now here. Uh, are they going to drop down on me? Here, have a, have a sharp stone. Oh, he has an iron sword. That's like the same thing. I just, I thought I'd help him out in this fight. And the main reason I wanted to help him out is because I know how much of a disadvantage he's going to be at. Because he doesn't know about the wall of steel. And to be fair, I'm about to try it for my first time too. So this is really cool. I also bought an invis with the other two because I had eight emeralds. But I realized I probably didn't need to buy the invis potion. Once I put down this wall and stand behind it, it's going to be like I'm invis anyway. Like, he will not be able to know where I am at all. I will be behind a wall of steel. Okay, it seems blue is going to be working their way to mid. Uh, let me just break this real quick. And uh, I got to chase him down. I guess he is making the only play he could, and he's going to probably get to my base. Oh, he's not going to my base. He has a free path if he runs from mid. But check this one out. Wait, he's using a knockback stick. Interesting. Interesting. I'll just keep chasing him. Turn around, dude. Turn around. Hey, nice jitter bridge. I mean, I could kill him. I just, I really don't want to. I want a wall of steel him. Let's see, what's his plan? He's panicking. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's crouching. He wants me to drop down on him. Okay, I will. I will. I'm going to go invis. He won't be able to see me. Wall of steel. Check that out. And check that one. Oh, wait. Okay. Oh, wait. You can only play... Okay, they had to nerf it because it was too powerful of an item. You can only place it every 10 seconds. And see, that is just the wall of steel power right there. I put down two and he realized, game over. I am going to jump off the edge. I don't think I'm going to get a single use out of the wall of steel this whole video. So if you're hoping for that, leave the video. All right, into the next one. Maybe it was just the map. I'm going to blame the map for uh, the reason the wall of steel didn't put in too much work there. But this map, this map looks like a wall of steel map. But first, of course, I got to take out my first rush. They seem to have fallen into the void, which is exactly what I want from a first rush. Someone who cannot make it to my base. They also bought a fireball. Joke's on them. They are going to be limited on iron now. Can I break your bed? Oh, you're going to let me break your bed. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, 
Okay, I got to rush mid. I need to be the first person to emeralds so I can get the wall of steel. So many good items could be bought with these emeralds, but of course I'm buying a... Uh, a wall, uh, but I can at least use it for some overpowered defense. Yeah, come on up. Yeah, good luck getting past my wall, loser. And he had to turn around because he knew there was no escaping the wall of steel. Like he is the server lagging, or because I'm pretty sure my first fight lag too. Either way, my wall of steel went down, and he knew immediately I got to turn around. I can't get past this wall. Uh, let me just steal his diamonds and go. I was thinking about rushing him, but I could buy some prot. And if I die, I give him those diamonds. I don't want to do that. No, don't go to my base. He's going to my base. All right, we'll bed trade. It's fine. Actually, I don't think I need to bed trade here. I can probably jump in the void in time. I'm going to go for it. Yeah, he's coming to my base. I have minor fatigue. Minor fatigue might save me here, but it's going to be close. Looks like he is turning around. This guy definitely thought about coming into my base, but he probably just remembered the wall of steel that I placed earlier and realized, you know, the wall of steel is too powerful. I'm worried he has another one. I should probably just go somewhere else, not to his base. And he is out of the game. I only have two emeralds in my E chest, so I got to go back to mid. I need more emeralds because I need to buy more walls of steel. Um, unfortunately, all the emeralds are gone. Who took them? Pink probably took them, I think, and then went to die to Aqua. So now Aqua has the emeralds. You know, this is totally fine. I don't know how many emeralds Aqua has, but I think it's a lot. Again, thanks to Pink delivering them all to him. He probably didn't buy a wall of steel with the emeralds that he has, and that puts him at a massive disadvantage. Okay, so here's my plan. I'm gonna run in, put down the wall of steel, and he just, he could not get past it. And check this out. Oh, okay. Well, I was going to try to run away from him, but he realized that he could smack me off. Okay, first I need to buy a tracker. I'll have enough afterwards. So, tracker first to find out where this guy is. It looks like he might be coming to mid. He is. He's right there. Hello, sir. Unfortunately, if he grabs the emeralds, uh, then that will prevent me from being able to buy a wall of steel. So... See, unfortunately, he put down a wall, but I was able to get right past it because it was not made of steel. It was, in fact, made of wool. Don't go to my base. Go away. And that is why, just a, yet another reason, the wall of steel is so much better than putting down wool. And uh, we're just going to keep showcasing how great this wall is into the next one. I just think it's so funny how they made arguably the worst rotation item ever. Just a wall. Three emeralds to purchase. Three emeralds is so expensive. You can buy bridge eggs, invis, which is the most broken item in the game. Speed, you, you're one away from an ender pearl, so, so you could even choose to do that. But no, you're spending three emeralds on a wall. Uh, hello, I'm above you. Are you threatened? Clearly they are because they did not make the jump to the diamond gen. In we go to aqua base. Don't hit me. Unfortunately, they did hit me. Even though I asked them very politely not to. Are they going to jump up there? Okay, here's the play. I just wait for them to arrive, and then now they are low enough that I can easily kill them. Okay, just a little bit of patience. That's all it took. Um, can I put this away? I can. But can I also get the kill? Yeah, maybe I could have gotten the kill if I didn't put the items away. I just wanted to be safe. They also left. They saw an empty generator, and they decided, you know... It's time to call it for this game. Let's move on to the next one. I went back to my base to buy sharpness, but I am now on the way to mid. I need to collect all the emeralds. Hopefully I can get all eight. That way I can buy, most importantly, two walls. And then I have two extra emeralds to spend for myself. Uh, I don't know what I want to spend them on yet, but it's going to be something exciting. Uh, I see the gray is on the way in. They are a final kill, so I wouldn't mind fighting them. Let's see, are they going to come up here? Let me just gap. I should get I should get these absorption hearts. Yeah, you should run. You should run. Unfortunately, if I kill this guy, he's not going to get to see my wall. Um, but I, I'll kill him anyway. He Maybe I'll queue with him again, and he'll get to see my beautiful wall that I'm going to put down. But I guess not this game. Um, I will continue going around mid, because, again, I need to get these M's for the wall. Green is on the way to mid now. Could you guys just let me collect emeralds freely, please? Uh, I'm just going to go to green base. If they're not here, also, if I saw that correctly, they are going to, like, blue base? Which, yeah, go get blue bed. I'll get your bed. Although, 
if everyone dies here, I don't get to show off my wall at all. In fact, I'm buying three. I have nine emeralds. I'm buying three walls. Okay, so green is bedless. Uh, blue is now also bedless. I'll just, I'll let them play their games. I don't, I don't need to get involved. Two bedless players, and this with a bed player is so stacked. They felt the aura of the wall that I was about to place down, and that is why they fell in the void. Oh, pretty good fireball placement, I'll be honest. I saw what he was going for. If he lands it like here, I get flung off to the side. Um, but I don't think he's ready for what's about to happen to him. Yeah, try to come up here. Just try it. Not happening. <laughs> and he got lit on fire because of my wall that I placed down. Unbelievably overpowered. Okay, check this out. This one's going to be even better. Yeah, try to come up here. Just try. Try to come up here. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, and he's going to have to work his way around the side. But I'm not going to let that happen. No way. Oh, wait. The wall went away. Dude, the wall is... Why is it so short? Yep. And check that out. Another wall. All three of my walls got use. Um, and it's just preventing this guy. How is it gone already? Dude, this wall is horrible. It lasts like two seconds, but he is too distracted by my amazing wall that I put down that he uh, just tried to build a similar wall over here, but it was not as good. And uh, that allows me to win the game. GG's, another great showing. On to the next one. I can't believe it. I am playing on rooftop. I haven't seen this map in so long. You should have seen the joy on my face when I queued into this map. Rooftop is definitely one of my favorite Bed Wars maps, so it's really nice to be playing on it again. I know that while Rooftop was absent, there was another Rooftop-based map in Skyrise, but like, Skyrise is no Rooftop. Rooftop is just unmatched, and uh, I think Aqua fell in the void and then disconnected, so very good. That's a free bed for me. And the free bed is exactly what I needed because I'm going to be heading mid to collect all the emeralds and buy walls. Rooftop is the perfect map to have walls of steels on. Um, don't ask me why because I won't be able to give you like a good answer, but just know that this is like the ideal map for walls of steel. And I think I'm going to be able to get all eight M's, meaning... I'm going to be able to buy two walls of steel and two emeralds to spend for myself. I'm not sure what I want yet. Invis, maybe? Uh, I guess my bed is gone. I guess rooftop has been gone for so long that people forgot how they're supposed to rush because White thought you should be side rushing on rooftop, and that's just not how you play this. But that's fine. I will bed trade. White bed is now gone. Pink, you don't have to do anything. You just chill at your base. That's really unfortunate that, uh that I had to get side rushed like that. I guess I'll do two bridge eggs, two walls of steel. Uh, also, I got the final kill on white. I don't know how. And that way I can just bridge egg up to mid. I don't want to have to bridge. But pink, you are not safe. I'm on my way into your bed. What is this defense? I'm assuming the bed is under these top two pieces. And uh, goodbye to your bed as they are rushing gray. And now gray bed is gone because of pink. Meaning, this is a bedless game. Now, because nobody has a bed, you might be like, this is a pretty evenly matched game. Everyone's on an even playing field. But no, I have walls in my inventory. I think green is trying to make it back with emeralds. They were in mid, but I must stop them. If I can take these emeralds back from green, then I might be able to successfully buy more walls. Because this fight is taking place in uh, the base here, putting it in your e-chest isn't going to work, dude. I'm sorry. I got it anyway. I wasn't able to put down any walls because it, I, I would imagine it doesn't work here. Yeah, it doesn't. But I do have three emeralds, meaning another wall. This is perfect. And check this out. Oh yeah, he turned around. He saw it in my hand and turned around. He knew that he did not want to mess with the wall. What is he doing? I thought we could have a nice little duel and I could put down some walls, but if he's just going to run, I guess that's fine. I wonder what gear they got though. Like, did they find a bunch of M's in mid here? Uh, it looks like no, seeing as these gens have two each. Let me just buy it. I'm going to buy a tracker. That way I can keep an eye on him. See what this guy's getting up to. What mischief is he doing? Okay, I think this gray player's in mid, meaning I'm going to quick invis up, and I'm going to go for the sneaky kill. I do have three walls, so I need to use them wisely. A misplaced wall would be detrimental for my gameplay. And check this out. You wish you could go to your base. That's just not going to happen. You're not going to your base this time. Here. 
Oh, no, he is going to his base. Because the wall goes away in like 0.5 seconds. What is that about? No. Okay, dude. What is happening? That's fine. We'll just have another duel. That was very close. And I have two spare walls to end the game. How... Why did he TP back? Whatever. That's a great game there. Uh, the wall really clutched it out there. <laughs> the invis wall uh, into the next one. I just can't believe an item this worthless and expensive on its own goes away in like one second. Like that wall was out for like one second. Who on the development team making these rotation items thought that that was a balanced item? Yeah, yeah, we'll find the Bed Wars players using this item. Um, I think Pink is side rushing me here, so I should probably be ready for that. Hey man, uh, yep, ouch, you hurt. Goodbye to Pink yet again. They really tried their best to get in there. Now, I just need to make sure I don't get hit off the edge because I'm feeling pretty good here. But he also doesn't want me to get into his base. And there we go. He's dead yet again. Uh, can I steal his generator? Or does he? Oh, he has three gold for me. Is that enough? My absorption heart's already gone. The gap was unfortunately not enough. But on the bright side, I did take all of his gold so he doesn't have that. Oh, and now pink is in a really tough spot here because gray wants to kill them. I want to kill them. Um, let's see. Can pink... Yeah, okay. They both died. That's actually perfect for me. Because I can take out gray right here as well then. And then I have pink and gray gone. Hey, gray. I'm just going to break your bed real quick. Hopefully you don't mind. Uh, clearly he does not mind. Okay, hold on. He does mind. I wish I had an axe. It, I, their bed would be gone like four times over if I had an axe. But that's fine. No worries. I'll just have to kill this guy like six different times. I guess it's only two, but who's counting anyway? Let me just say six. And I have not gotten any emeralds. How am I supposed to buy a wall in this game without emeralds? Because for some reason, you have to spend emeralds to get the wall. What is that about? Now, unfortunately, that guy bought diamond armor over there on blue team, which is a decent use of six emeralds. However, when I get six emeralds, I will be buying two walls. But I feel like you could argue that the two walls are actually nothing because they go away so quick that they don't have a chance of doing anything. I have my two walls and I have two bridge eggs. I'm going to be going in on red here because I changed my mind. Green killed red. Therefore, I think I'm going to go in on green. Green fell in the void on their own. Okay, I'd, I'm just going to wait in mid. They both died. They're fighting each other. Why get involved? I can just take my sweet time here and then eventually make a tactical choice on who to kill. Nah, I think I'm going to go in on green. Green's over at blue. It looks like red is stalling for me. Red knows that they're just going to wait for the bed to be gone. And now I would imagine red's going to jump in and try to take the kill. And yes, red was able to snag the kill. Um, Are they? Yeah, they're just going to run over here. I don't want a bridge fight. I feel like I'm way more geared than this guy. And yeah, he wants me to bridge fight. So that's yet another reason to not do that. And he fell in the void on his own. Okay. I don't know if that was on accident or on purpose though, because like maybe he wanted to get back to his base and heal. Either way, I'm going invis. Doesn't matter. Red is on the way out. Wait till they see this play. Big wall of steel. Where did they go? Wait, did he have not in... How did he get past me? Whatever. Maybe he's just better than me. Uh, he probably is also confused as to how I passed him because I was invis. I actually... Did he... T Maybe I'm just... I'm probably just blind. You could always chalk it up to just me being blind. Uh, let me just throw a bridge egg here. That was possibly the worst bridge egg use ever. Red's on the way in. But watch this. You're not entering. You have to stay out of mid. He's gonna go over the wall. Oh, the wall's gone. Hey, man, you don't have to worry... None of this would have happened if it wasn't for the wall disappearing in literally two seconds. What's he doing? Are you going to jump on me? I'm waiting for him to jump. Come on down. There he is. Okay. 
He didn't even get to hit the ground, he just died in midair. Almost an amazing ending until I threw myself into the void. GG's. This is probably the worst rotation item we've ever had. It has actually just no value and it's three emeralds, which is crazy expensive. This was really hard to make a video on, but we got it done. Well, that's gonna do it for this episode of Bed Wars. If you enjoyed, make sure you smash like, sub, check out the various links in my description. I don't know where they're gonna take you. Um, hopefully you don't get any viruses, but you can click the links in my description. Uh, if you feel like taking a chance, then thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.